die. You were born here, so you will. But I'll be alone. I'm so sorry, Henry. It's not gonna happen. I'm not gonna let it. You did this, now make it stop. I can't. There's no way. Well, figure it out. It's your fault. Stop! I already lost my dad. I don't want to lose anyone else. We have to work together. From the mouths of babes. I'd say the lad is a point. It's <laughs> for the last time we met. Bloody hell. And tell us why you're here before I use something else other than my fist. I think threatening to kill me is a bit redundant when we're all about to die anyway. No thanks to you. Regina just told us you were working with Tamar and Greg to get your revenge. Well, that was before they told me how to die to get it. We don't have time for this. We have a real problem. Which is why I'm here. Because staring death in the face has made me realize if there's one thing I want more than my revenge, it's my life. So shall we stop this thing now and then resume bickering? There is no stopping it. And the best thing I can do is slow it down, but that will only delay the inevitable. Or give us the time we need. The time for what? Steal back the beans. Use them to get everyone back into the Enchanted Forest before Storybrook is gone. How? We don't even know where Greg and Tamara are. Well, I do. I can help. Yourself, he'll take the remains all behind. Why should we trust you? No, we won't have to. I'll go with him. If he tries anything, I'll shoot him in the face. Quite hostile, aren't we? Just being clear. I'll take Regina to slow down the diamond, give you guys time. Mary Margaret, take Henry, gather everyone, make sure they're ready to go as soon as we have those beans. Henry, before you go. Sorry for what's happened. I tried to be the person that you wanted me to be, and I failed. But I won't. Let you be alone. You just know that I love you. I love you too. Things we do for our children.